everybody, how's it going? This is Farscape, this is season 2 and this is episode 18. This episode is called A Clockwork Nabari. This is obviously going to be something in relation to Chiana. What I really like about what Farscape does with these types of episodes is we get really nice character driven and character focused stories and I like that quite a lot. Every time we get one we learn something new about someone we already thought we knew. There's always little surprises that come up and kind of take us take us back at times I guess and we're like oh I never expected that at all. So I'm looking forward to seeing what this one's about because the last Chiana really centric episode we had was Taking the Stone at the beginning of the season then we where we learned about her brother and the very first time we met her at the end of toward the end of season one really. It'll be nice to see a little bit more about her because she is still quite elusive even though she's having this new relationship with Dago. There's still parts of her that we know nothing about so I'm looking forward to getting on into this. Let's go. I got information on the slave auctions, didn't I? Quit tripping me. Dargo will be happy. Dargo's not going to be happy if he finds out how you got the information. Dargo won't care how I got the information. Did she as sleep long with as somebody? You, son. you needn't worry, okay? I can look after myself. I think yes, she's yes, I know. You can kick, someone. kiss, and cry your way out of any situation. I just wish you'd stop getting into them. You know, we barely got your ass out of there before that guy and his buddies turned nasty. Oh. You just crank because Winona jammed. Winona? has been very reliable. Why is this going to call Winona? She jammed. And Aaron and Rigel had to stay behind to cover our asses. You can bet they're going to be really cranked when they get back. Yeah, Aaron will. Aaron can yell at me as much as she likes. You need to hope that Aaron only yells. I want to apologize for not looking after you better. My behavior has been self-centered and inappropriate. What? I don't get it. <laughs> what don't you get? Well, we just had our asses whooped, saving Chiana. Mm -hmm. Rigel's happy. That's scary. <laughs> what happened to them wherever we they were? have a surprise for you. <laughs> for me. Don't the Nabari do things to you? Something's not right. Aaron doesn't even they've show been, without a They've been pistol. decked. Shit. Chiana. Shit. Go talk to Dargo. Chiana, dear. Yeah, screwed. It's time to go home. They're cleansed. No! I'm never going home! Do you hear me? We've got the same hairdo. Aaron! Don't let me hurt you, Gianna. Drop the weapons. Let her go. Face. So oh, yeah, your gun doesn't work. Is Gianna aboard? She yeah, is. She is. And we must honor our fallen shipmates and deliver her as. I love how they cleansed Aaron, but they've still got a collar around is her this neck. This ship contained. Ah, ah, Officer Son, Aaron, why are you doing this? We need your cooperation, pilot. No harm will oh. come to you if you cooperate. They look like something out of saw. Regrettably, your species nullifies the effects of the mental cleansing process. Therefore, we must. Resort to the use of the color. For color. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Please do as I ask, and I won't have to use the color again. What do you want? Bala's ship had a run in with the Peacekeeper Patrol, probably from Scorpius's carrier. Please make sure that Moya's sensors are on full alert. The patrol may still be in the air. If there is even a chance that it is, then we need to starburst immediately. The caller! If this Leviathan goes into Starburst, the collar will detect it and automatically inject a lethal dose. We must get to the... It is like Saw! Please do so, Pilot. We would not like to lose you. When you first came on board, Elvis had you in cuffs, dragging you back to Nabari Prime. Now we got Deborah Harry doing the same thing. <laughs> Why are your people so jazzed about getting you home? That woman looks like she's been through the bad part of hell just to get near yeah, you. Yeah, she does. Her face is do messed that? up. Gianna, you must tell us. Gianna, when these people came on board, they were after you. That makes you the it girl. You've got something they want. What is it? I don't have anything. Well, he, yeah. that dude said something about your other sister's information. He kept asking me about the resistance, some kind of resistance. The guy took Dargo away. He called you the sister. What did he mean, the sister? Neri? I've only been sister to one person. That's Neri. Is there some kind of freedom fighters thing going on here? He's dead. We didn't escape. The government gave us exit permits. Right? We didn't know why they made it so easy. We didn't care. We just ran. We just ran. It wasn't until two cycles later that 
Mary found out why. Can't believe it. Believe how much it hurts. What did they do to them? I, I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it either. But I got through it. You will too. What's the first test? The contagion will be, will be completely out of my system. Contagion? That's what I was told. And I won't be spreading it anymore. What the hell did they do to her? You and me, we're both clean. Just wish I could say the same for all the others. Your own people infected you with some kind of disease. Disease. Mary. Me. Hundreds like us. And then sent them out with permits. Maybe thousands. Probably think you're still in contact. Oh Jesus, that you dude listening. To... <laughs> They're all so battle scars. It is his time, Chia. Soon it will be yours. The treatment will help you by removing all negative impulses. Tell him. Oh my gosh. Um, it's true, John. All the things I've done as a warrior. Oh my god, they've broke Dago. All the horrible thoughts I've had, all the cycles of my life. They've broke Dago. you, I am so sorry. You don't have to do this. Oh, I can't. I can't even look at I can't even look. That's horrible. Stay the hell away from me. Don't do this! It is either mind cleansing or death. Hey, isn't that against your Nabari Prime Directive? We are in difficult times. Oh, I'm drastic we measures. Must do whatever necessary to serve the greater good. Oh, it's very clockwork. Orange. Oh, my God! Oh! Don't struggle. The patches will release a chemical into your neural system. You should feel the effects almost immediately. Thrill the thrill the thrill the thrill the thrill it thrill it thrill it. Resist resist resist. Fight them. Harvey might quit you. Fight them. Fight them. Fight them. If you've also come to tell me what a wonderful thing the Nabari are doing for you, I am not interested. Nabar 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 is the death. I'm here to tell you that the Nabari are a bunch of geeks. And the damn mind cleansing doesn't work. Oh, Mama Crichton's baby boy. John Crichton, astronaut, master of the universe. It's because ah. of Harvey, but not because of John. How? I don't know. They gave me the full Monty, and it was working, and then I got this, 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 this... Vision? Flash. It was like it was soaking up the drug. I snapped out of it. And what is it they want? They have some vast plot to take Infect over a chunk the of the galaxy. Ah, Vala gave me the coordinates to a Nabari outpost. We're on our way there. Oh, well, can't you veer off course, slow down or something? Officer Sun comes in that. often, checks the readouts on my panel, and Starburst is out of the question. I don't want my eyes sucked out again. Freddy, shut I up! Like my eyes it's me! <laughs> he wasn't even cleansed! What a little shit! You mean, you're not affected either? No! <laughs> Keep your voice down. I've been having these... Uh, forget about that. Right now, we gotta do something, and I mean fast. We? Yes, you, me, and Pilot were the only ones who aren't Nabari puppets. I'm nobody's puppet. I don't know what you're suggesting, but I'm not angering these people. They're not mad at me, and that's how it's gonna stay. Buckwheat, I need your help. This can only be activated by contacting your DNA. Oh, oh it looks a bit like a, a massive memory card for, like, an, a, a camera. Hey, little sister. I told you we'd see each other again. Well, at least you're seeing me. I don't know how much you know about what it is I'm doing, but it's important work, very important. Is this this resistance they're talking about? Whoever gave you this image disc is one of my people. Treat them well, they're a friend. But they're also under my strictest orders not to take you to me. Look, I just wanted you to know that I'm alive and well. Keep Did he destroy his own sister. stomach disc? And out of harm's reach. I love you dearly. They said that they, they got chased by a peacekeeper patrol, right? Yes. It's perfect. I got an idea. What if we made them think that it came back? I don't understand. Is there some way scared. that you and Moya could fake them hunting us down? It appears as though we're being shadowed by a peacekeeper patrol. Service, sir. Report. Commander Crichton is correct. Oh, Moya she called him service, sir. A squadron of prowlers closing fast. Prepare for confrontation. With what? She's a leviathan. She's she no doesn't weapons. have any weapons. Detail. Pilot's so How clever. How they find us? 
I am Captain Captain Grace. Command commander of the peacekeeper plies our regiment. Our sensors sensors detect the presence of aboard your vessel of an of a Navari star runner which we have we have been pursuing. A boarding party being dispatched. Do not do not attempt to turn them away. Do not do not test me. Oh. Oh. You know you don't have to kill her. This entire peacekeeper experience. It's a ruse. No peacekeeper command carrier? No. Pilot, terminate the simulation. The commander, the vessel attacking us is real. I thought so. Captain Jesus. Pilot, terminate the simulation. Oh my god, like, if I had <laughs> released pilot's control collar, we would starburst away from your rendezvous point. <laughs> oh, that was a good blow. <laughs> Did that work for you? <laughs> I thought it worked. Mm. Definitely. Yeah, pilot. It worked. You're the best. This episode I thought was lovely, actually. As much as that woman was so happy to press the button to try and basically kill Chiana, I thought it was a nice little way to help everybody discover that Neri wasn't dead and he's actually part of this resistance. This was had Star Wars written all over it, this completely. Some of the lines, some of the way that they blocked the scenes as well, really reminded me um, of the original trilogy and it just made me smile. I thought it was really cool. What I didn't like about it was this acid colour around a pilot's neck. That just upset me greatly because of, he is my favourite character in this and any harm befalls him and I get really annoyed by it. But the fact that he was able to create this fake kind of bombardment by peacekeeper ships and throw this Nabari lady like just totally off kilter I thought was a genius plan. What a good little editor that guy was as well to put all those clips together, especially with Chris. Getting everybody mind cleansed was interesting. Knowing that Rigel, because of his metabolism, didn't really affect him, but obviously it affected Dago, Zan and Aaron, didn't affect John because bloody Harvey inside was basically taking the hit and he was keeping John, John. But obviously John doesn't realise that and I wonder if at some point he learns the truth of why it didn't affect him so much. But Harvey had a bloody use there and it was a good use. It kind of kept everything on an even keel. And knowing that this guy was now going off to help Neri and Shiana's been left behind. I do hope at some point she does get to see her brother again because that would be quite nice for her because since the beginning of the season she's thought him dead and to have a little reunion for them would be nice. And now we're off to where the slave auctions were held um, to try and find Dago's son. I believe there's another three parts coming up so I'm intrigued to see what that entails. It's probably going to do with these slave markets, I guess. I might just go start that trilogy and I will see you guys later, so thank you.